guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my Stitch Fix unbox. No. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my Ipsy unbagging for the month of April. I'm so excited because I heard that tomorrow's weather is going to be up in the 80s. <sighs> guys, this is like my favorite time of year. I just love this. Everything just looks so pretty and the windows are open and the flowers are blooming and we can go outside with like bare feet. It's just like one of my favorite times of the year. So I did kind of peek at this month's bag just a little bit to see if there was anything I could try on with you guys. And there are, there's a couple things that I'm gonna try on with you. So I didn't like put on too much makeup today. Let me just tell you guys before I get started. I have started this like super weird habit. Well, it's like, it's like a weird habit. For the past few months when I drink my coffee, I've been watching Wendy Williams. I guess I'm at that point in my life where I'm just at home with kids all the time. And I don't have any drama. So like celebrities and like <laughs> people on TV are my drama. And today was such good drama. Like it was all about Chloe and Tristan. You guys, drama, 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 and I love it. Like, I was like, no, girl, no, he didn't. It's like so much fun. Anyway, this is this month's bag for April. It is beautiful. In fact, Starla, you told me that you were so excited for this bag, and it is really pretty. It's got butterflies all on the front, and it's ready for spring. And then on the back, it's just this really cute lavender color. And I also just noticed it's got this, like, little pink shiny stuff down in the corners. And the theme for this month's bag is Social Butterfly. So you get this little card with your bag. And on the back it says, fact, life's too short to skip all the fun stuff happening right now. It's so true, so true. Okay, so the first thing that I got in my Ipsy bag is this brush right here. And I'm guessing it's an eyeshadow brush. And it, no, it's a concealer buffer. Wow, I would have been using this on my eyes. I mean, this looks like an eyeshadow brush, doesn't it? <laughs> and it's by the brand Vasanti, which I've never heard of before, but um, but it feels really nice. It just looks like an eyeshadow buffer, which is probably what I'll use it for. <laughs> I'll try it out. I'll try it out and I'll let you guys know what I think about it, what, I'll, what I will probably use this for. But my first guess was that it was an eyeshadow brush. But it feels really nice though. It, it feels really nice. This is this is cool and I'll see what I'll use it for. Okay, the next thing in my Ipsy bag is, oh, I like this brand so much. I've had lotion by them before. This is by the brand Hemp's and it is for your lips and it's an ultra moisturizing herbal lip balm. So it says it's enriched with 100% pure natural hemp seed oil. Oh, well it has like, one of these like little, you know, little lip guidey things on the top. I just thought it was gonna be like a squeeze tube, but it's, you know, actually for your lips. It's hard to push up. Mm. Oh, you guys, it smells so good. And, oh, mm, mm, mm. oh my gosh, it tastes good too. It kind of smells like a little bit like suntan lotion. I wonder if there's any SPF in here. I don't see any, but it does say that it's paraben free, gluten free, 100% vegan, and THC free. <laughs> this feels so good on my lips, and it smells good, it tastes good. And I've owned some lotion by this brand, and let me tell you, it is one of my all time favorite lotions ever. It smells so good, and it's just nice and like smooth and creamy. I really, 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 really like this. I've never seen their lip stuff before. I'm, I'm really excited. Okay, the next thing that is in my bag is by the brand Aurora, and it is for all lip lovers. I'm guessing, oh, it's a lip stain. So it's a 24 hour lively lip stain, and it's in the color soft pink. So now that I've just greased my lips up real good, <laughs> let's go ahead and try this, hold my mirror right. So this says it's supposed to be a 24 hour lip stain. Let's try this out. All right, so first I just wanna say real quick that I love lip stains and one of the reasons why I love them is because it makes your lips just kind of look like they're naturally that color and you don't have the look of like lipstick. 
This is a really pretty color. It went on nicely. The only problem was I kind of had to turn it to the side to get more of the color out. But that might just be because I had the chapstick on first. And what I do like about this is that it had like a really nice tip so that you could line your lips really well with it. But it looks really pretty. Let's see how long it lasts. I'm really excited for something like this. This is different and I'll let you guys know what I think about this in like a future video. All right guys, the next thing in my Ipsy bag, hold on, I have two things. They kind of look the same, so I'm gonna take them both out. Yes, okay. So they are by the brand Wander Beauty and they are baggage claim gold eye masks. And there's one pair in each of them. These are individually packaged gold foiled eye masks to brighten, hydrate, and reduce the appearance of dark circles. Experience three innovative layers of luxury. The gold foil helps retain heat and prevents evaporation, allowing the maximum amount of serum to penetrate the skin. The middle layer is elastic, allowing the masks to adhere better to skin. And the third is a cellulose fiber that condenses and delivers key ingredients efficiently, giving you all the skin loving benefits you need. Hyaluronic acid delivers intense hydration to diminish the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. Aloe leaf extract and lavender oil offer a cooling effect while soothing and calming the eye area. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'm sorry. That was a lot to say, but I just got caught up in actually reading. This is. This sounds really cool. This sounds really intense, actually. I love that it has hyaluronic acid in it. I heard only great things about that. And the fact that it has, like, lavender and aloe. I, I just, I really like the way this stuff sounds. I'm not going to try these on with you guys, but I will go ahead and try them on um, another time. And I'll let you guys know what I think. Alright, guys. And the last thing that's in my Ipsy bag for the month of April is... If you guys watched my last video on my top 10 favorite beauty products from my subscription boxes, you guys know that I love this product and so I am super excited that they sent me another one. So the last thing in my Ipsy bag is the Ofra Cosmetics Blush Refill. It says on the back, Blush Chameleon, so I'm not sure if that's the color or not, but let's go ahead and open this up. So as you guys see, it comes out like this, and it has the metal on the back like that. And what I do with this, ow, my foot's asleep. <laughs> so what I do is I have this palette right here, which is from Ofra, and this is their pop-up palette, and you open it up like so, and you just add the new blush in there like that. So now I have two blushes by them and you guys can see the difference in the colors. This is the one that I said that I really love last time and this is the new one. It's a little bit pinker, pinkier, pinker, pinkier, pinkier, pinkier. <laughs> so let's go ahead and try this color out and see what it looks like. Oh yeah. Yeah, can you guys see? It's like nice and pink. This is going to look really pretty in um, in the spring and summer. I really like when my cheeks look rosy and I think this did a really good job. So yay, I'm so excited. So now I have another thing to add to my palette and that was my entire Ipsy bag for the month of April. I really liked this month a lot, actually a lot. I think this month was a really great month. I got all sorts of different products that I don't usually get. The only thing I have to figure out is this guy right here because I immediately thought it was going to be like an eyeshadow brush. The fact that it's a concealer brush will probably throw me off a lot, but I'm definitely going to try it out and make sure that I give it a chance as a concealer brush before I just add it to my eyeshadow collection. As far as all these other products, I really liked my bag this month. I love the masks. I love, love, love this brand. I love the way this smells. I love everything about Hemp's. I just really do. And this thing right here, I really like. I think this is a really cool product that they sent me. I like lip stains. And if it works really well, I, I'm most likely will use this so we'll go ahead and see how I like this in a future video but yeah that was my entire ipsy bag for the month of April what do you guys think about my bag this month did you guys get your ipsy bag and if you did what did you guys get let me know down below I like hearing what everyone gets because I love the fact that everyone's bags are like different and unique but yeah this month was a really great bag for me I really liked it again thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys have a great day enjoy this weather Watch Wendy Williams because she gives the scoop. <laughs> if you like this video, please give me a big thumbs up to let me know. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!